because my own situation hadn't been that great with the humans that were involved, it was the best solution available or it, there was no solution available. So I created the solution based on what I personally wish I'd had access to. Montrealer Ratika Dutt took her experience of dealing with being stalked and created an artificial intelligence system right here with Botler AI, where Canadians in a similar situation she was in can get access to legal resources and tell their story to a bot that can point them in the right direction, one of the first of its kind in the world. When I was going through my own situations, I really tried hard to speak up and it was just difficult because a lot of the time, it, you take so much it takes so much strength and courage to go and speak to somebody about it and then perhaps they're saying okay you're not reacting appropriately or you're too upset or you're not upset enough and it puts so much self-doubt in your own mind that it's much easier to go and speak with a system that doesn't have these emotions at the first steps. Ratika launched Botler AI in 2017 in the heart of the Me Too movement in response to the workplace and social media stalking that she had been experiencing for half a year. It wasn't dealt with appropriately or at all. And really, it made me so insular. I was so scared, broken. I, was, I felt so alone and I felt like this was just what I was destined to deal with until the day I died. Ratika and her team created Botler to allow users to chat with the bot and describe the details of what's going on. Botler will go through a series of trauma-informed questions to ask more for more information about the situation that the user is dealing with and kind of extract key details as we're going through the process. And at the end of this process, what Butler does is perform an analysis to see what are the potential laws that may be relevant to the situation that will then be provided to the user to understand their situation better. With online tools that will then explain the relevant laws in layman's terms. If somebody could go and see that there were these laws written in black and white, it would help them change their mindset and say, OK, this is something that's real. Canada's Department of Justice recently announced they're giving Botler AI more than $300,000 in funding for their latest initiative, Botler for Citizens, which is going to eventually service Canadians in all regions. Currently, it's launched in several Ontario regions and will expand into more provinces as their network grows. Then we would provide them with the referrals to their community partners that can provide them with the human in the loop services, whether it be legal advice, information, counseling services, and so on. And that's where the Department of Justice comes in, helping us to facilitate and grow this network. Those not in the regions currently serviced by Botler for Citizens can go online and request access. Botler will then manually give you resources within your community. I really encourage anybody that's dealing with a situation that has questions that is not sure, am I dealing with something? Is it in my head or not? To come and test it out, to come and have a quick confidential conversation with Botler and to understand the situation with a little bit more detail and then decide how they'd like to proceed. In Montreal, Alicia Rubertucci, City News.